Welcome back to another episode of Greed Four, guys. Uh, as discussed last time, uh, we had just freed Jonas and we are going to prioritize my cousin, you know, finding him. And then we are going to rendezvous at Captain Dagaba. So let's go. So last we heard, my cousin got uh, kidnapped by a bunch of crooks. And they're holding him down in the lower barrows, if I'm not mistaken. So that's where we're off to. Down this way. A lot! If you had any idea who I am... Don't run up, imbeciles! I have a ship to catch! That vulture of a tavern master was right. It is Constantine's voice. It's coming from the floor above. It sounds as if he's locked up. And I have a feeling they're expecting company. Be careful. The slightest itchy word to these brutes will have them drawing blades to scratch it. Negotiation may be the solution. As you say, this breed of brutes won't spit on ransom money. What a waste. I'd rather sneak around them than give half a coin to these seedy fellows. Yeah, I'm not going to negotiate with these people. They legit kidnapped somebody, so... No negotiations happening here. Okay, let's see. What's this? It's not possible just now. I don't have science. Okay. It's blocked. Like I have to use another entrance now, don't we? Uh, enemy detection. When the player is in stealth mode near enemies, a detection indicator will appear above their heads. If your presence is detected, the indicator will fill up until you are perceived as dangerous, which will trigger combat. The indicator has two states, suspicious in yellow and detected in red. Shouting like that, we should have gotten rid of him. Don't be an idiot. It's obvious that he's a noble, a rich man. He needed to be taught a lesson, but it's better we grab some coin. With all those posters we posted, someone with deep pockets will show up sooner or later to liberate the rooster. Oh, that's he's making a great deal of noise. We could knock him out or gag him. I don't have a key. Damn. Um, I get lose that. Oh man. <laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. Um, okay, yeah, I came in through there. Ooh, ooh. Nice, 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 nice. I know my cousin's on the higher floor, but this is our way out, remember? Nice, nice, nice. Just unlock that quickly. Thank you very much. Oh, nice! I got a criminal key. Does that mean I got the key to that chest? This chest. You know, for a profitable business, three gold coins is really not a lot to be finding in the chest. But then maybe that's why they're profitable. Just as in your right. A lock. Nice. Uh, 70 gold coins, that's more like it. Just keep creeping. Just keep creeping. Take it. What is it? Oh, okay. The key to my cousin's cell. Okay, what's in here? Some loot. I 
There's a chest over here. Nice, 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 nice. Well, this has been monumentous, gentlemen, but I have more important things to attend to. An island to govern, treaties to sign, riches to expedite, and a demanding father to impress! Ha! Constantine, it's me! My dear cousin! Oh, my lucky star! Always there to pull me out of my fight. Well, I do what I can. We're departing soon. Your father wasn't pleased by your absence this morning. Have you ever seen him happy about anything when it comes to me? You know what he thinks of me. He cares about you, I know that. He appointed you governor, didn't he? He is ridding himself of a source of constant disappointment. <sighs> Enough said. Today we set sail for adventure. What's worth this too? They both have daddy issues. Companion equipment. Select Constantine from the inventory screen with the pad left and right. Equip Constantine with his outfit, old embroidered. Don't if play. you only knew how these river scum treated me. Do me a courtesy, good cousin. Now that we stand boldly alongside the brave Kurt, let's give them their money's worth. They haven't spotted us. We could sneak out of here silently. We have a ship to board. You've always been the reasonable soul. Don't you think these brutes deserve a punishment? Yes, without a doubt. But don't you think there are more pressing matters? Kurt, it is your highness's decision to make. Whatever it is, I shall follow. You know what? We're gonna teach them a lesson. Because, first off, they shouldn't be kidnapping people. Secondly, it's experience that I kinda need right now, so... Let's go. To my help! And death to the others! Move away! Things are about to get dicey! Perfect, perfect, perfect. How to Pasco? <laughs> Just a whole lot of dead people. This plague really did us work on the city, eh? And their corpse management is really not good. It's quite poor actually. Sir? Constantine Dorsey, future governor of Tier Freddy. I'm enchanted, Captain. I am eager to board your ship. Enchanted as well, Your Highness. I hope you enjoy your voyage. Are you ready? Can we weigh anchor? We should be able to set sail with the tide, as agreed upon. My cabin boy, Jonas, is back on ship. I have you to thank, I imagine. You do. It's a rather sad affair, and though solved, leaves a broken family behind. All we can do is plot a course. No one tells the wind what to do. I do thank you. I didn't think you'd go to so much trouble for a cabin boy. Your actions bring you honor. Thank you. Permission to come aboard. Permission to board the ship. We are ready. Certainly. But keep in mind that we'll be at sea for several months. If you have any farewells to make or any final business to put into order, now is the time. I think I took care of everything. I need to... The only thing I have to do is at least talk to Kurt's new quartermaster on the new island, so... No, my Let's house go. is in order. We are ready to embark. Perfect. Follow me. Eager 
to discover Tia Friday. I leveled up. My isle. My new city. You'll need to arm yourself with patience. The voyage will be long. I've been told the trip lasts months. And they say the place is full of gigantic creatures. As big as buildings. That's right. Increases my life. I heard the Norts even brought one back in but one of their ships. To I doubt oh, that. The Norts are strange. Increase the power of the all Nordians. melee attacks. Tribute required to wield the best one handed, two handed blind weapons. Uh, I'm gonna take that. Yes. And the skills I can finally take one handed blades. Nice. So at some point I can start equipping blades again. And I'm also stronger with it now. Perfect. But I'm gonna focus into melee and and magic. I like the two. But I'm pretty sure you're gonna need a character to burst in all of them. Let's look for more loots. Any more loot? No more loot? The beast is awoken! Those conniving, pistol-stilling, bridge-building liars. The creature was supposed to be out for days. They'll pay for this. What the hell manner of cargo are you transporting? Help! We need ropes! We must contain it! Help! Come now. Let's lend them a hand. Shoulder a little. Ah, ah, that was too much. Ah, I think I'm dead. Um, let's find that. Oh, oh, yo. Okay. So. Oh, oh. <laughs> Am I even? Uh, mm -mm. Okay, last save game. Uh, okay. Let's find that. I have one potion. Nice, two more potions. Let's do this again. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Where did I get the gun? Green blood. How do you fare? Fine, fine. It is dead. Are you wounded? I'm well. Your lessons have proven effective. I've never seen a beast this size. It's quite extraordinary. Cousin, what a fight. You were illustrious. I'm not of the same mind. I had the feeling it was already weakened. I did nothing more than finish it off. Your humility remains a constant. But believe me, that battle was absolutely epic. Yeah, man. It actually looked like, like, like it was scared towards the end. I actually feel, I actually don't feel good about the fact that we just killed that. Although, I kind of understand that we needed to. I still don't feel good about it. Gentlemen! <laughs> Woo! Your cousin's enthusiasm is most impressive. And this journey is his long-awaited chance to prove his worth. He has a demanding father. More likely he's just happy to be free of this hornet's nest. I definitely know I am. That's certain. Stations, lads! Weigh anchor and ready her to wear! Lively now, lively! Catch me a win! Charming welcoming committee. Gentlemen, I am Constantine of House Orsay, your new governor. I have no idea what sort of ceremony you've prepared for my arrival, but I would gladly skip it, so... <laughs> indeed, indeed, these are rather peculiar customs. I, I see, I see, it seems you were quite intent on serving me a drink. Hello? Cat got your tongue? Gentlemen, would it be those annoying beaks? <laughs> I am truly sorry these doctors should have shown a greater measure of courtesy. Thank you, dear doctors. Move along, don't trouble the noughts. Pay no attention to them, instead just drink. The long voyages at sea require the appropriate treatment as soon as we land. According to our scientists, without fortifiers, you might catch your death, and that would be quite regrettable. I should have chosen death. This concoction is liquid torture. I would think that they would have warned you on the ship. No, not in the slightest. And you must be Lady Morange, my predecessor. You are correct. There you are! To your health. Aha! You got your dose of bile too. 
Allow me to present to you Lady Morange, and to you, my dear lady, my most trusted cousin. Where is the captain? He seems to be preoccupied with some sort of admiral. Indeed. Then I will have to thank him later for this most marvelous voyage. Excellency, lead me to the palace, I beg you. And, whenever possible, go by way of all the intriguing alleyways. I am dying with impatience to discover this new city. My city! Uh, your Excellence, we must wait for our escort. No need. Have no fear, for I am here to defend you, my lady. I've been scullied. How so? My admiral laid me off. My cousin was nonetheless delighted with your services. I hope there was no misunderstanding. None, I'm sure of it. She just ordered me to give you any assistance you might need. This request doesn't seem to please you. Don't take offense, but it's not pleasant for a captain to abandon his ship. In any case, here I am at your service for a while. Vasco is a duelist whose extraordinary agility compensates for his lack of protections. He also knows how to handle guns with great ease. Nice, nice, nice. So he's from the, the faction of the Nords and their relationship with me is still suspicious. He uses one-handed blades, like me, but he also uses guns. He can coat his blades of poison and he has a secret blade technique. Nice. And I leveled up. Wonderful. Um, let's let's increase the effect duration and talents. Ooh, here we go, here we go. Is it worthwhile to pick a lock picking? Mm. Does this me recover? No. I'm gonna take lock the key. Yeah. I got a memory crystal. Resets your skill points so I can allocate them again. Nice, so at any point I could change to be a robot or something. Cool, cool, cool. We can do this mission somehow now, now that we landed. Um, yeah, let's go do that, but I would like to explore this place. Never been to Hickman. It's a very impressive city. There's so much places to go. I don't. I have no idea where where to like even go other than like with our, with our objective markers. Maybe. Aren't you a part of the prince's family? I believe I saw you with the governor. You believe it, right? How much load? I understand why this place looks like a mess. It's just been passed. Construction is still underway here. Yeah. Okay then. 
beginning. Seems this place just looks overly complicated. Oh, you're a merchant. Excellency, welcome back to my modest shop. It is an immense honor for me to be of service to such noble clientele. What might I do for you? Let me first sell some goodies. First things first. All these potions need to go. And I didn't use guns. Right? Next. That can go. I cannot sell while I have a deco. Nice to know. That can go. That can go. Keep that. That can go. I can't equip this. But maybe Kurt can. I can't equip that. Still. Maybe Kurt can. Yep. Thank you for your visit. See um, you soon. What is this? Oh, okay. The BC edit. Uh, let's equip stuff for Kurt, not you. Kurt. Put on better gloves. Nice, nice, nice. Put on better boots. And back to me. Agility. Ugh. So frustrating. Come closer, good people. Liqueur and wine from the continent. Tier for the alcohol. Custom pieces made to order! Greetings. You look like someone who would know how to use a blade. If you're looking for the best steel, you're in the right place. Weapons, armors, ammunition, I have it all. And if you have a special request, my associates will be glad to make it for you. Cool. Let's go see for weapons. Agility, agility. Strength. Agility, agility, strength. I'm having a feeling like maybe I wasted a point. I need to get the agility. One I'm how bent on like using agility with we'll this. make it for How yeah. bent on it. Also, I haven't found any magic rings, so it's also that. Now, where do I get the agility? One-handed plates. Tributes. Is it here? Here we go. Agility. In two more levels, I get a point that I can put into agility. I shouldn't have chosen a strength when I did. I should have chosen agility, but I did not look at the weapons because I'm a fool. Although, I do have this item that lets me respect this. Search the skill points and allocate them. I will probably use that between episodes just to reset my points. Well, I'll be damned, it's Captain Kurt. Manfred! Still a quartermaster? Always, as you can see. What can I do for you? We've come to find you regarding the merchandise that Kurt was taking care of. Ah, the commander's cargo, yes. I was told that had come in. And so he's got you working on this. Lucky Kurt. It helps to have friends in high places. Is everything in order? Alas, no. Our merchandise has been unloaded into one of those dock storehouses. They're well guarded. A little less at night, but in spite of that, we weren't able to get them back. Since these crates are registered in the ship's manifest, make an official request. The modification of the manifest might have fooled a quartermaster, but it won't fool the port authority. We'd have too many details to explain to them, and our commander would not like that. What? 
Is he waiting for us to bring them to him, then? No, of course not. But Kurt needs to find the right storehouse, as well as a discreet way to get in. And he must also mark the crates that belong to us. Why is that? They're already marked with an inscription. Most of the men are illiterate. A coloured mark will stick out for them to find. But they need to be quick about it. They won't have the time to decipher a name. I see. Well, let's see what we're able to do. Is there anything else? No, thank you. Does this shift? Why are we doing all of this stuff? Give me this. Two coins. Uh, Vasco, do you mind? Thank you. Jeez. Search us, please. I'm gonna do this for three. I'll buy something in return. Grab it, fellas. I have a feeling if I loot this, if I lockpick this, they can erase me. Nope. Give it all. That's my way, man. Anyway, I'm gonna call it here for this episode, guys. Um, yeah, I'll probably respec my skills uh, off in between episodes, but I won't change anything to be honest. Um, the only thing I'll. Sorry, I'm distracted by Luke. The only thing I'll, I'll most likely change will be this attribute right here. Instead of strength, I'm going to go with agility, just so that I can equip my swords. Anyway, goodbye. Thanks for watching.